Hello everyone, welcome to my space. My name is Elizabeth. Today on Easter Monday, I'll be sharing with you what I have prepared for my family. And I'm starting today with a cup of hot coffee and a little bit of hot chocolate mixed and um, half and half milk. That is what I use. Quickly, I'll be introducing you to the ingredient I use for my chicken. I use chicken wings. You can use any protein of your choice. I have thyme, I have curry, I have ginger, I have allspice, I have um, salt, paprika, thyme, curry, and I think cloves, if I've not mentioned cloves. So these are what I'm mixing. The green seasoning, you can always comment down below if you want me to show you what I do with that. Now for my rice, I have one whole pineapple. I'm going to use some of it for the rice and the rest will be for my other ingredients later you, you see in the video. So for my fried rice, I'm, right now I'm boiling my rice. My water is hot so I'm adding some oil and then I'll add my rice to kick start that part of the, so that I can multitask what I'm doing. Then I have fresh kidney. You can use any kidney. I'm using the goat kidney and I have the kidney beans. I have sweet corn, pineapple, shrimps, ball pepper. I have the red, the orange and the green one. I have spring onions. I have red onion and I don't use carrot but I always use carrot in my food. This is salt that I'm adding to my rice. I'm adding a little bit of water so that it can be a little bit soft. Then I will go ahead and clean my pineapple, wash it very well. I already washed it, um, soak it in vinegar water because I'm going to be serving my food. That's going to be our plate. So I'm going to serve my food in the boat. Let me call it boat. I don't know what's called boat for the fried rice for presentation purposes. So after washing it thoroughly, I still scrub it. And then I will go ahead and process my pineapple. Tell me, let's talk down in the comment section what you add for Easter. What, what did you cook for your Easter? Did you go out? Did you cook on Sunday or you cooked on Monday like me? I was so tired, I couldn't just help it. So I had to push everything to Monday. Thank God for understanding family. So this is how you're going to prep your pineapple. You cut it into two halves. That is if you want to use the back of the pineapple for, for, for serving your rice, serving the food, then you can always go ahead and cut it this way. I'm showing you right now. Then you use a smaller knife to just partition it and then you scoop it out. You can use your spoon and scoop it out it's very easy to do you can you can do it it's very 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 easy to do i love pineapple rice because the pineapple brings sweetness into the rice some people add sugar and onion but no no the pineapple is this pineapple i'm using is even overripe is it is overripe it's an overripe pineapple because i've had it for like almost a week and i was like oh i'll just wait and use it for easter and all that so here i already made my i'm partitioning my pineapple trying to bring up the inside and not affecting the outside of it so that it can hold my food like a bowl
because this is the second part of the penipo i'm just trying to show you so that you'll be able to get it and see how it's being done so that you can get your penipo but you can always if you don't need the the back of the penipo you can always always buy like the canned penipo and just use that but i love the I love the pineapple bag because um for presentation purposes purposes sorry i love it for presentation purposes purposes i like it it looks presentable it's it looks um classic and it's a feel of tropical environment you know so i so much love it Yeah, I'm almost done with cutting my pineapple and I will not believe the rice is boiling. I'll be serving this with um zobo, some people call it hibiscus um um drink. Um some people call it um so or something. I'm sorry if I'm not pronouncing it well. So I'll be using the rest of my pineapple for that. Um comment down below again if you want me to make a video on how i make the drink that i served with my rice i hope you all enjoy our easter break i hope we had fun with family and friends i really enjoyed my easter because um i had what i've been craving and longing for for a very long time right now Okay, so I'm slicing my onions now. I use have the onion, you could use all, doesn't really matter. Yeah, this is my fresh kidney. I've added it in the freezer and I, I just put it together with my sweet corn that I have as leftover. So I always have it in mind that I'll cook this with my next fried rice. So that was how you have the yellow stuff on it. Those are um, sweet corn. So I'm just cutting it into smaller pieces now. Then I will boil it. Because it's not cooked, it's still fresh. And you can you can skip that part but i just love to have a kidney in my fried rice any fried rice that doesn't have kidney i, I, I still look at it that uh-uh this is no this is not fried rice but people these days you know get away with it that's okay that is another sweet corn because one i have will not be enough so that is my sweet corn then i love kidney beans too some people substitute instead of the fresh kidney they use the bean the kidney beans but i love to use both i love my fried rice to be really really rich and crowded i skipped um um carrot in here but i always use carrot i always forgot about it i have carrot in my freezer but i was just overwhelmed and tired you can see i'm preparing my shrimps right now if you notice i'm leaning on the on the on the sink because i was just so 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 tired but i needed to cook for my family i i derive pride in cooking so no matter how tired i am sometimes i push myself and coupled with that i didn't cook on sunday so i'm like no i'm not gonna skip it today though if i tell them i'm tired Oh, I love them, they will understand, but I just want to put a smile in the face of my family. So I'm remo removing the skin and then I'll be removing the mm, all the stuffs inside my shrimps. And I always cut my, because I have a jumbo shrimp, I prefer to cut it in smaller chunks instead of leaving it that big i prefer to cut it so eventually later on i did cut my 
shrimps then i added salt to my shrimps you can add seasoning to your shrimps to you know to give it more to bring out the taste then i'll set it aside i already washed my plantain no no good rice without plantain yeah that is my right uh, my kidney that I, the kidney i washed not my kidney <laughs> but the kidney i washed then i'm prepping my my plantain the plantain i try to do two different styles so that just to show you some ways you can just do it if you like it in smaller chunks or you like it big yeah so if you like it in cubes you just do this style and if you just if you don't care you can just do the other style you'll see it soon Please don't handle the knife like this at home if you are not comfortable with it. You can always cut on the cutting board. But I'm used to that. Sometimes I forget that I have the cutting board or shopping board or the cutting board. So sometimes I forget about it. I just go ahead and do my thing. But if you can't handle the knife because those knives are really sharp, please use your cutting board. I don't add salt to my plantain no matter how ripe or unripe or unripe they are now I'm using Kerrygold um, butter and this is the unsalted one that I like to use so the oil the, the oil I chose to use for my rice is just the butter I love this butter so much it's because it has a lot of fat in it healthy fat in them and not just water so I'm adding my kidney not my own kidney but I'm adding the kidney to the food you know I'll, because it's boiled so I want to fry it a little with the with the butter then I'll be adding my shrimps later There's a secret behind that pot, the stainless steel pot, you'll get to see later on in the video. Yeah, when you see the pot unattended to, um, I'm also trying to get uh, across with other things. So I'm frying my onion now. I think on the other side I'm boiling my rice I, I boiled my rice separately to make life easier for me you saw that at the beginning that was the first thing I did to boil my rice then when I finished boiling my rice I started frying the plantain on the other side yeah so I'm ready to add all my greens wow I love it when it's colorful wow I love it when it's colorful. I will be cutting the um, the hot pepper inside in a little bit. By then, I ended up using just half of it because um, the weather is so cold. I don't want it to be too spicy, so I just did one pepper inside. But sometimes I can use all three. I just change my mind. Uh, let me just make it mild. I'm 
using this opportunity to say a very big thank you to everyone that has been supporting me, subscribing, commenting, sharing my videos. I really appreciate. Thank you so much. I'm adding salt to the veggies. Is my time a little bit more of the salt yeah the rice is going in if I show you everything all the way by steps this video is going to be too long because this video is already long it's like 20 minutes already or even more than 20 minutes so i have to you know compress it yeah the rice is almost ready i think i lower the the what's it called now i lower the Flame, yeah, flame. Yep, then my shrimp and my and the kidney, not my kidney. <laughs> the pineapple will be the last thing to go into the rice. Yeah, that will be our last ingredient. The rice is ready here. Yeah, that is me frying my plantain. I just wanted to show you. Yep, that is my plantain already those are my chicken prepped adding my pineapple i don't like the chunk to be too big so that's why i'm using my hand to you know break it down a little i really 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 enjoyed the meal i enjoyed my easter monday it was a cold day all day and it was so cozy with this hot rice yes though i still ended up having a cold drink i don't know sometimes it's cold but i still want something very cheap so you get what i mean later on in the video Let me know down below what you want me to prepare, what video you want me to, what food video you want me to to make for you. Comment down below and I will try and make it. Then um, yes, this is the drink. This is the zobo. Those are pineapple and lemon. So I'm adding my apple, uh, pineapple in it. I have apple and lemon. Sorry, in it. Then. I'm adding my pineapple. It's so good. I enjoyed it. It's so good. Wow. Those are my chicken. My wings. I love me some wings. So I just decided to do just a little bit in the air fryer. I have other in the oven. So I just did those in the air fryer to be fast because oh i was so hungry the time is gone i think this is around after one to two on easter monday and we've not eaten anything oh i love those i added on some i made some um what are they called now ketchup and um barbecue sauce i can always do a video on how i prep my chicken wow thank you so much everybody this is my presentation i really love it i enjoyed it my family enjoyed it they were happy they were appreciating comment down below any video you want me to you know show you and i'll be happy to do that because i love to be in the kitchen then i'll be doing some shopping haul videos coming soon thank you